Hello and welcome to Daily Dose Radio, a five-minute a day podcast studying the Psalms verse by verse, recorded here in the dining room of the Bible Bistro, located in Sharonville, Ohio. Hey there, friend. Welcome back to Daily Dose Radio here in the Bible Bistro. Today we're in the dining room of the Bible Bistro. I hope that you'll hear the bird song today. I've got the windows open. It's a lovely day here in southwest Ohio. So we're going to look today at Psalm 86, all this week, Psalm 86, which I've entitled The Grand Supplication. This has an introduction. It's called A Prayer of David. That's the introduction. And so we know that David's back. He's going to give us simply a prayer. And it is a wonderful prayer because we have supplication, thanksgiving, and praise all throughout this prayer. And you know me, I love to pray the Bible, and what we have here is more material for us to take into our closets. So this is this is one of those prayers that we can just open it up on any day at any time and just read it as our prayer and maybe you know add a few personal notes as well to it because there are some statements in here that we might want to add to for example the third verse be merciful unto me o lord for i cry unto thee daily about and then maybe we would say what well, you know what we're crying unto him daily about so this is what I call the grand supplication. It's one of those great designed prayers. It is a prayer that we can pray. It's a prayer that we can look to for instruction on praying because it includes all those things that I mentioned. And we have some great theology here too. So there are three verses, and I'll come to those as we proceed through the psalm, which give us something about the character of God. And so we'll talk about those as we get there, but they're very important. And there's a couple of key verses here, too, that I I don't want you to miss. And so I'll highlight those as we go through as well. So we're going to read today verses 1, 2, and 3. If you have your Bible, open it there. If you don't and you can't, uh, let me read for you. Bow down thine ear, O Lord, hear me, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my soul, for I am holy. O thou, my God, save thy servant that trusts in thee. Be merciful unto me, O Lord, for I cry unto thee daily. So there's the first three verses here, and you can just hear the the supplication just in the imperatives. Bow down, hear me, preserve my soul, save thy servant, be merciful unto me. So we have these imperatives that he uses because he's crying out to God, and this is what he wants. He wants the Lord to hear him, to preserve him, to save him, to be merciful. And then you notice that he ends the same way as he began there, I cry daily unto thee. So he said, bow down your ear. You know, I cry daily unto thee. He squeezes into those three verses all of these requests. Bow down your ear, O Lord, and hear me, for I am poor and needy. Now, poor and needy, we find that where? One of my favorite of all time psalms, Psalm 34, verse 6, the poor man's prayer. The Lord, I cried unto the Lord, and he heard me and delivered me from all my troubles. So that's the poor man's prayer. And here he says again, I am poor and needy. I, I misquoted Psalm 34, 6. This poor man cried. So David always seemed to consider himself poor and needy. Even though he was a king over a kingdom, yet he considered himself poor and needy. Friends, you see, that's where we begin with prayer, is we don't go to God to negotiate. We go to God because we're poor and needy. And once we understand that we truly are poor and needy, then we won't have any problem going to him in prayer and asking God to hear and to preserve and to save and to be merciful because we we need all of those things, don't we? Every day we need those things. So this is sort of an everyday prayer. Yeah, it's the grand supplication, and yes, it's written by David, and it's wonderful, but I'm telling you what, we could open our prayer book to this psalm every single day and pray it. Bow down your ear, be merciful unto me, O Lord, for I cry unto thee daily. And maybe there's something you're crying out unto him daily about. Well, he's a merciful God. Be merciful to me is the what you pray to the merciful God. So, friend, go do that today. I'll see you tomorrow. We'll look at verses 4 through 7 here on Daily Dose Radio. Thanks for listening to Daily Dose Radio. For more fresh and delicious Bible studies, podcasts, books, and more, 
check out the Bible Bistro online and on YouTube. Join me again next time for Daily Dose Radio.